Okay, Andy, I'm going to talk to you about confirm shaming. Have you heard of this? No. Okay, so confirm shaming is the act of guilting the user into opting into something. Oh, so you mean like when you go to an article and it says, do you want the latest news about UX delivered to your inbox? And then the options are, like, there's a form and you can fill it in and say yes. Or the other option is like, no, I don't want to be up to date. Or like it's something like really guilting in on the decline button. Exactly that, yes. Right, okay. Let me show you some okay. examples. Oh, okay. Is that on a cash machine? So this is one of the cash machine. Okay. In, so, Amer- in America. I've never seen adverts like that on British cash machines. So it says... I wonder what, why, why in Britain do we not have adverts on the cash machines? Because we've got taste. Yeah, okay. Go on. Okay, so it says, no, I'll miss out. Fairly tame one, that one. Yeah, yeah, that's, okay. that's fairly tame. So this yeah. one says, sign up and save, but if you don't want to, it says, nah, I like paying full price. I find that so... Oh, that would just put me off from shopping there. Is that I just know, me? me too, yeah. I it, just, or, or what I would probably do is dismiss it, and then if I actually ended up wanting to buy something from there, I'd open the website again in the incognito window, so the pop-up comes up again and get the coupon. Oh, that just sounds inconvenient. Maybe. Okay, so this one says, no thanks, I don't want to have more fun on my bike. <laughs> That's just... <laughs> it's horrible though, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, this one says uh, this is for tea and if you don't subscribe I like that though that's fine like no I don't care enough well that's kind of a legit no well I think that's what they're going for but what if the tone isn't quite what you're thinking this one's just bizarre yes or reject no that's okay I think that's okay as well alright fine there's a lot about price this one says no thanks I'd rather pay full price I think obviously they're trying to get someone to take an action right Uh, trying to get someone you can see by the weighting of the on a lot of these the confirm versus the the no thanks is in tiny oh it's really tiny yeah no thanks I'll be the last to know yeah which is fine that doesn't really concern me too much I'm okay with this but I don't know maybe they're going for people who yeah. who want to be the first it, to know is this a recent pattern I feel like I'm seeing it more don't recently know. maybe than... maybe with sort of companies wanting to be a bit more chatty and informal maybe that means that they've kind of gone a bit too chatty and a bit too well I think there's informal. a fine there's a fine line between chatty and informal and just making your users feel bad for yeah not, for not wanting to be bothered yeah. by your marketing community this one again is about price no thanks i'd rather pay full price for delicious tea but just a bit weird yeah so this one's about a sale no thanks i don't like to save money you see the problem with, with a lot of these ones especially like this is that who doesn't like to save money right there's not really anyone who so so what you're doing there is you're saying you've got no option right if you do, if you don't want the marketing campaign but you also do like saving money there's, there's no option for you they're putting words in your mouth and i don't like that yeah i'm the same yeah i agree similar one about food no thanks i don't like delicious food well obviously everyone likes delicious food yeah but they might not necessarily like your marketing rubbish about a four-week meal plan yeah uh this is one about getting subscribers no thanks i'm fine with losing customers where did you find these? There's a Tumblr. There's a Tumblr oh, that wow, just collects okay. them. This is I, I'm just ripping all of their content off there. I'll link to it in the in the notes, but it's worth just having a look because some of them are just bizarre. No thanks. I'd rather do all the hard work myself. <laughs> One's about pets. I think they're really trying to they're really trying to go for your sentimental yeah. aspect. No thanks. I don't care what my pet eats. This is different. So this is uh, for using an ad blocker. Yeah. Which is going to prevent the website owner from getting any revenue from ads. Yeah. And you, you'd have to click the thing saying, I'm a bad person. Yeah. It's a bit too cringy, I think. Well, it's that website owner is literally calling someone who doesn't want to see ads as they browse the web a bad person. And I don't think that makes you a bad person. Not even that. It, they're making that person call themselves a bad person. Yeah, well, you have to choose, right? It's like, stop hitting yourself, stop hitting yourself, stop hitting yourself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, another one for a newsletter. Mm-hmm. No, thanks. I'd rather not learn. Nope. I hate good times. Again, who hates good times? Nobody yeah. hates good times. Yeah. Rubbish. What? That made no sense to me at all. I'm not looking for an easy way. Oh, this is it. I'm not looking for easy way. Doesn't even make sense. No, that doesn't, even, that doesn't even make grammatical sense. <laughs> so we talked about putting you words see, in people's mouths. that's kind mouth. of funny, actually, though. That's, I, I don't know. Like, but if what it's... if you really don't like canned soup? Well, no option for you. Yeah. You close the browser. Burn your computer. <laughs> Maybe eat that. <laughs> <laughs> this is for a logo really don't need an amazing logo no but that's fine right like some people you might go on this website and you're just interested in logos but you don't you don't have anything to apply a logo to you're not a business owner yeah true that's that's the right text in a way true what 
Are you sure you want to cancel? Cancel my subscription. Never mind, I want great games. See, that's different. That's actually kind of okay, I think, as well, because that's putting a positive spin on it. Okay. Yeah? That's like saying... I think this is for someone who's trying to cancel a subscription. Yeah. But that's not shaming them, is it? It would be shaming them if it said, uh, continue with subscription, and the cancel said something like, no, I don't want great games. But they flipped it, right? Yeah. Cancel is quite clearly written, but they're trying to get people to not cancel by putting... Little, little hook, little incentive in Which there. I think is better, actually. Yeah. yeah. Why not make it a positive positive thing on the action you want them to take yeah why isn't it why aren't these things like yes i want to eat tasty food rather than subscribe on the positive action and no i don't want tasty food on the negative action it could be it could be flipped around right yes i'm interested in tasty food on the positive and then on the negative you just say no thanks doesn't need to shame people on the no it can just be a positive thing on the yes i think you're right actually yeah this is the most bizarre one what? Don't get that. It's all on the uh, on that little testimonial. I want to hug the people that created this, and you'd have to choose. No thanks. I hate hugs. Doesn't make. I think it's making link. They're, they're all making links that they shouldn't be. Yeah, I know. And this one it's for a fashion company. <sighs> I feel like we need to start a campaign to burn these. Well, de- definitely, they're awful. Would you implement this on a site? Uh. Have you implemented anything like this on a site? No. Are you saying what w- would I object if I was told to? Yeah. Oh, difficult, isn't it? Someone's paying you. Yeah. But I definitely wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> oh, this is for uh, speeding up your website. Yeah. So you have to say you're happy with your slow website. How do they know that? <laughs> what they should do <laughs> they is don't. To implement some kind of scanner that you type your web address into. It checks how fast it is. And then it could say, no, I'm happy with my slow website. Are you making this into an advert for your product? No, just, just saying. All right. That's the end anyway. Oh, well, they were interesting. <laughs> <laughs>